I don't know. But good morning, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. It's Wednesday morning. Let me take my glasses off real quick. It's Wednesday morning. And I'm going to take you guys through another few days in my life. So um, I'm, I'm just working today, tomorrow, and Friday. <laughs> Um, nothing crazy. I am taking, I am doing Botox this evening, um, and on Friday, and I did Botox yesterday. I did my first Botox on, like, a client yesterday, and you guys, I was, like, literally, like, gonna have a panic attack. Um, it was, it was very bad. I mean, like, not the Botox, but, like, it was very bad. Like, when I was going to draw up everything, I was just like, I am so free, I'm so freaking out right now. Um, it was more of, like, an the thing with Botox that I, I've always known, and that's I think why I've been like slightly skeptical about it, is you are serving kind of a clientele that can be not as appreciative or, and not that they can't be because they can, um, they can be very nice and stuff. But when you're dealing with somebody's medical problems, I feel like ten people tend to be nicer, and I don't know, I don't know if that makes any sense, and I don't really know how, like. How, what I'm trying to say about it besides that you're serving typically a higher clientele so stakes are higher um, they're not typically really like genuinely the stakes aren't higher because when you're dealing with somebody's actual like medical history in their life I'm more worried about that but I don't know does that make sense probably not but um, anyway then I'm taking Seth to the airport later this evening because he is flying out to Indiana for the week spend some time with his family um, enjoy like his last week off before he has to report back to work uh, on August 1st and then tomorrow I'm thinking I'm gonna get my nails done and yeah and then I'm doing Botox again on Friday so I don't know I thought I would just bring you guys along I'm gonna try to get clips of my Botox this time too um, import footage to you guys so that you can see it on TikTok because I, I mean on YouTube because I do upload it on TikTok if you're interested in that but yesterday I couldn't film it I was too anxiety ridden so um anyway welcome back to the vlog I'm just taking my vitamins for this morning my probiotic just dropped it and let's have a good day you boys are being very good this morning who's you does not want me to go back in and get ready. He said he's coming with me. So you're not getting back in this room without me, Mom. <laughs> Ooh, I always have like 101 things that I'm carrying with me. I'm going to attempt to go to the gym today and I'm really hoping I make it. Because um, I didn't get to go yesterday because I was doing Botox during lunch. So I really want to go today. I did take a long walk with Seth, but I just sleep better when I work out, honestly. Okay. Let's go to the... I was about to say, let's go to the gym. Let's go to work. Hey, Jose. Where are you going? What you doing? Come on. Hi, Bubba. Hey, cute boy. Yeah? Stinkers, I got you a present. It's a present... It's a present for Richard too. Oh, oh my god. Camper loves balls. He has an obsession. Huh? I got stinky balls. <laughs> Look at him. He was like sitting up on the top here. Where is he camp? He said, I got balls. Oh my god. I was mean to him earlier. So. Obsessed. Oh, oh. Sit down. Amazing. Good boy. illegal that it's nine o'clock and I have the overhead lightings on. 
but I just dropped Seth off at the airport because he is headed to Indiana for the week. That's where he's from, so he's going to like visit his family um, because he goes back to school and like reports back to school in a week and a half. So he's he has just been a jet setter this summer. He's been all over the place, but I am home. So it's nine o'clock. I need to shower. I'm not washing my hair, but I really do need to wash my hair. But I am washing it. Um, I did Botox today. I'm going to insert the clips here oh my god the lighting you guys i'm so sorry the tear <laughs> thank you no thank you i can't wait to see me too i need to show you guys what i got from merit beauty they sent me a package and it came in this cute little bag like i don't know if this is a purse or what like it came tied and i guess you could like carry it like this i don't really know but <laughs> they sent me their blush which i did wear today and then a lipstick so um i will try those on and show you guys maybe tomorrow morning good morning you guys it's thursday i literally put this on <laughs> in front of my um thing so that i would remember going to work it's 7 15 and i'm going to my other office. I think I told you guys last night, but I'm going to my other office to pick up the hemoglobin machine and take it because I need it this morning. I promised somebody that we would have it. Do you think you'll be at Everell's by eight? Megan is sick. Oh, great. Oh. I need to think for a second. I'm gonna like pull over in the car. My MA is sick. Okay, so I guess I might be drawing these labs <laughs> which is fine but I I haven't drawn labs in a little while so and it's a child <laughs> not like young young but um younger so we'll see if I get there by eight o'clock she they're like sending another away because my and my who I work with over there is not feeling well today so hmm we shall see after 15 minutes of looking I found it it's now 7 50 it takes me like 20 minutes to get there I forgot my coffee at home <laughs> I think we do have like a coffee machine at work that I can make a coffee from thank god otherwise this would just be like just give up on the day because it's not going to be good because I have to have coffee like I'm addicted to caffeine like I'll have a headache if I don't so anyway oh yeah yeah I, I just like you try to do something nice man and it just what is that saying like no good deed goes unpunished yeah that's how I feel this morning we'll update it's lunchtime I'm headed to the gym this morning was just complete and utter chaos I I think you guys saw that, like the MA who I usually work with called out and so they were asking if I could be there to draw the people's blood because they were sending another MA but he lived really far away. This person's gonna ram me in the back. Um, anyway, so I I drew their blood, whatever, but I couldn't find like the hemoglobin machine and I forgot my coffee at home. Oh, it, it's just tragic, but Thankfully, we have a coffee machine at work, so I just made like a black coffee and drank it, which was fine. And then I think I, I maybe saw three patients this morning, so it's been really chill, um, which it always, not always, knock on wood, it usually is at this office. Sometimes it gets crazy, like with the buildup of people, but it's nice to have like that break in the middle of the week because it's, our other office is like so crazy all the time. So it's nice to come here and get like calmed. <laughs> <laughs> when you need a break from the chaos. So I'm headed to the gym. I think I'm gonna do a Maybe like a glute workout because I think I did hamstrings already this week So I think I'm doing a glute focused workout And then we'll go back to work for the afternoon. I have um, a lot more patients scheduled this afternoon I was thinking I need to get my nails done as well So I'm gonna call my nail lady and see if I have time for that This afternoon. It's just like it's a busy day. My right, workout is done headed back to work for the afternoon 
it's really hot outside it is july in florida baby i did a glute workout and it was pretty good i haven't i think i i get asked a lot like why do you go to the gym during lunch because it seems like you're really rushed to get back and well yes sometimes that is true like yesterday i had like my full two hours of my lunch break so i had like a good 45 minute workout at the gym so most days i probably get in 30 minutes at the gym which is not my goal like i like to be at like an hour um 45 minutes to an hour but it's just better for me mentally to go to the gym during lunch than to go after work because if i go after work then i feel first of all the gym is crazy packed and then I feel like I'm rushed to get home so that I can make dinner, so that I can shower, so that I can take my dogs on a walk, so that I can go to bed. It feels like so regimented. Whereas if I don't have anything scheduled, like I don't have to go to the gym after work, I feel like I have more free time, which, you know, it all evens out, but it just feels better to me. It's a psychological thing. Hi, what is he doing? Hey, gorgeous boy. What's your brother doing, huh? He's being bad. Of course he is. Of course he is. Oh, oh. that was Mama. What you doing, Lucy? Okay, I'm jumping. Hey, 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 hey. Where's Camp? He's outside. He is. Do you want to eat? Are you hungry? This would be where I left my coffee this morning. It looks disgusting. All right, let's feed the boys. You guys want to eat? Hey, Sting. <coughs> Camp, are you want to eat dinner? Alright you guys, I went to the nail salon, I don't know if I said that, to the vlog, I went to the nail salon, got my nails done, I did Suzy Chase's in OPI, which I really like, it's just like a, a soft pink color, and I got them cut because they were way too long, and I was having trouble like doing Botox and stuff on them, but it's all good now, I look really tan in the lighting I feel like right now, but I am just going to eat, oh shoot, they put feta cheese on it. What is that? Okay. I got Greek food from Hungry Greek and I got the falafel. Yeah, the falafel bowl. No feta, but I ordered it online. So they probably just forgot. So it's cool. Just pick off the feta cheese. No big deal. And then I think I'm just gonna sit outside, relax. We just ate dinner outside, but now there is a big storm rolling in and there has been a storm every night like when i get home which is just summer in florida for you and hoosier's not scared of storms but camper is i bet you he's under the bed it's camp Hoosh. Hmm? it's just like i want to be in the video anyway i'm sure he's under the bed he hates thunderstorms i'm thinking i'm just gonna shower i need to wash my hair tonight and then i need to pack for tomorrow. Going live on TikTok. Good morning, you guys. Happy Friday. Good. Oh, I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm getting coffee out. It's Friday. I almost made myself a cup of coffee um, because that's like my normal routine, but I am like going to do something new where I go to um, Starbucks or another local coffee shop on Fridays and grab myself a cup of coffee something different and do like a series on TikTok so this morning I think I'm going to grab a cinnamon dolce, dolce latte from the Starbucks but we just need to get ready I'm leaving work a little bit early today because I have an eye appointment um, so happy Friday mm -hmm. 